Hello guys and welcome to the Sharpset video blog. Today I'm gonna tell you about the keyword sources. I will show you all of the places in Sharpset where you can pull the keywords from for your projects to create the huge list of keywords. So let's go ahead and jump in. Keyword source number one. Keywords that you already rank for. Yes, you can get this data from Search Console, but Sharpset is much better at it. First, it will show you what keywords you've stopped ranking for recently, and you probably want to go ahead and change that. Also, you can use filters to see what keywords you rank for lower, and go ahead and optimize your pages to improve your rankings. Keyword source number two, your competitors. Go ahead and type in your competitor website or any website for that matter into the Sharpset search bar, and you'll see what keywords they rank for. If you're analyzing websites like Amazon or something huge with lots of categories and you are interested in just one part of that website, go ahead and use filters. Type in the beginning of the uh, URL category in there and we'll show you what keywords that category ranks for. For example, you have something like website.com that sells three types of wares. They sell toys, guns and bicycles. And you are interested in just the toys. So go ahead and type in website.com slash toys into the filter and we'll show you what uh, keywords that part of the website ranks for. And then you can add the part about bicycles as well by using the same filter. So we'll show you what keywords both parts of this website rank for. So go ahead and analyze any competitor you want, no matter how big it is. Keyword source number three, the cool old fashioned keyword research, the simplest one. Type in any word you want into the Sharpset search bar and we'll show you what keywords we have that contain that word. For example, you type in the keyword bike and we'll show you all of the keywords in Sharpset that contain that same word. You can sort them by search volume, you can analyze keyword difficulty, you can remove certain words or add certain words to them with the filters and add just the keywords that you are looking for to your list. Keyword source number four, related keywords. That is a section of a Sharp set that shows you something like LSI keywords. We basically take your initial request and see what pages rank for it. Then we take those pages and see what keywords those pages rank for as well. And then we compare the keywords from all of these pages. And when we see some intersection, we show you that uh, these pages, like out of these 20 pages, five rank for this keyword. So this keyword probably related to the one you've entered before. Go ahead and try it out. Enter something like fitment, a keyword related to a car scene and, and uh, car wheels. And you'll get results like what wheels go on Chevy Silverado, what is the Audi wheels offset and stuff like that. Go ahead and try it out. Keyword source number five, search suggestions. Again, type in any keyword in the search stat and head on to the search suggestion sections. We'll show you the keywords that Google shows to its users as they type in the words you've entered. Plus, you can filter them to show only the search suggestions in forms of questions, which are great for content ideas and just knowing in general what your audience is interested in. Keyword source number six, anchor clouds. Again, competitor research. Type in your competitor's website, go to backlink analysis and take a look at their anchor list. They are probably using some keywords in their anchors that you may want to go ahead and target as well. Keyword source number seven, ads. You can get ads data by entering a keyword or entering a website. Go ahead and try both. Enter again your competitor's website and see what keywords they use in uh, Google advertisements or type in any keyword and see what ads related to the keyword other websites ran on Google. Keyword source number eight, missing keywords. If your page already ranks for a sufficient number of keywords, we can find competitors for your page and see what keywords those competitors rank for. Then we can compare the lists of keywords from your page and their pages and show you what keywords they rank for that you don't rank for. And you can do the same for your competitors URLs as well. So this gives you a lot of opportunities to find new keywords. And I guess that's it. Eight sources of keywords from Sharpset. Go ahead and try them all out. Enter a keyword you want to check, uh, find the competitor's sport, analyze your competitor's semantics, find their keywords, change that initial keyword, analyze other competitors, repeat the process until you're satisfied with the results and until you have every single keyword in your collection. That's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, subscribe to our channel, hit like, share it with friends, and I'll see you next time. Bye.